Yeah, you're good, Dylan. Let's 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 pass this on. Alex, you want to grab something up there? I'm not sure. I, I believe that top that top line quite. Does that, does that seem right? Or this one? The top. All the way to the top. Okay. Um, well, I was going to say I don't. Well, it's not that I don't agree with the squares, but we don't really have to deal with the squares because if we notice a right here, this a. Okay, we're just going to look at the z point. So A is this right here, and then B is just this right here. Um, and we know, we know the, what these lines are. It's just R cosine theta, um, because R is going to be our hypotenuse. So we can just write it out as R cosine theta. And then um, B is on the I axis. So of course, we're going to have to add an I in there. But it's just I R, cos R, I R sine theta. So we don't, I don't understand why we're having to use the squares, because we hadn't before. And so we could just write it out as this, and then S would be the same thing. But first, um, we can then factor out the R's. So then you would just have R cosine theta plus I sine theta. Um, and then you do the same thing with uh, W, except you're using phi, because that's the angle that you're going to be using. Um, so that just equals the same. Th uh, and instead of R, because R is no longer a hypotenuse, S is. So we just use S cosine phi plus I sine phi. And then that's what you multiply together up here. So stop just for a second, Alex. Let me ask you a question. Go ahead. Gabby, you had a question, or you wanted to jump in there? No question. OK. We'll get you. We're going to have you punt. But before you, uh, you move off, Alex, what, what is this? And term. I see here. R is this, is this, is this what you meant to say here? It's also equal to that? No. Uh, cause this, cause what this is this thing then actually? This is the distance from the origin to Z. So That's this is actually what Z is. So this is really Z. So is that in the form of A plus BI? Because A is R cosine theta, B is R sine theta. Say it again, Sean? Because A is all, um, R cosine theta in this case is A, and R sine theta is B, and then R sine theta is multiplied by the Alex, can you uh, right? say it one more time, Sean? But Alex, put your hand up there as he's saying it so we can see where he, or Sean, just go up there and do it. All right. Show us where you're saying it. So basically,